Some North Carolina students are taking a step back in time. In this morning's In Session Report, see how students are learning history by becoming it. Hi, my name is Tom Streps and I was born April 13th, 1743. At Jarvisburg Elementary in Currituck County, students are traveling back in time. My name is Eleanor Roosevelt. I was born October 11th, 1884 in New York City as a very wealthy child. They become this person and they bring it to life. For 16 years, fourth grade teacher Leanne Heflin has been pairing up students with historical figures. Hello, my name is Henry Ford. The students spend weeks studying their lives, then coming in full costume for the Wax Museum. And I'm famous and important because I created, well, the Ford Model T. They get to learn about people from the past, good positive leaders and role models. They learn about failures and how people overcome failures and major accomplishments that help shape America today. My name is George Washington. I was the first president of the United States of America. From presidents to athletes, musicians to inventors, even a special section for famous North Carolinians. They're going to remember this more than anything else probably this year. For other students in the school, it's a chance to learn and be entertained. And for the Wax Museum actors. This means so much to them. It's like their stars for a day. It's their time to shine as storytellers while learning the history of some of our nation's most influential leaders. Thank you. Have a nice day. These in session reports here every Monday on Daybreak. If you have a story idea, let me know by reaching out by email or social media. I have to say thanks to Jarvisburg Elementary for having me down. That is a, a heck of an event they put I, on. I'm telling you, that was really creative. A lot of fun. I enjoy that. Those kids are cute. Yeah. Aren't they uh -huh. sweet? <laughs> the costumes are excellent. Yes, I'm sure they learned a lot too. Yeah.